Hola everybody, hello friends, how are you all? I'm back yet again with another Spanish video. The topic for today's video is numbers in Spanish. Do you all know how to count in Spanish? Let's begin. Okay, if you're all Ricky Martin fans, you would already know how to say number one, two and three thanks to his Uno, Dos, Tres song in Spanish. So that's Uno, which is number one. Then we have dos, number two, tres is three, this is cuatro, cuatro, number four, cinco, we have number cinco, which is five, seis, six, siete, seven, Ocho, eight, nueve, number nine, y diez, number ten. Let's count from one to ten again. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, Ocho, nueve, y diez. I hope that's clear now. Should we go ahead? Okay. How do we say eleven in Spanish? That's once. Once. Number eleven. And here we have twelve. Doce. Doce. Let's proceed. Trece, thirteen. Trece. Catorce, number fourteen. Catorce. Quince, fifteen. Quince. Dieciséis, number sixteen. Dieciséis. Trece, catorce, quince. Dieci seis. Let's move on. Dieci siete. That's number seventeen. Dieci siete. Dieci ocho. Dieci nueve. And finally, number twenty is veinte. So if you would have observed the pattern. Dieciséis, diecisiete, dieciocho, diecinueve, and veinte. Okay? Now, how do we count in twenties? Let's check. We have twenty-one, and twenty-one is called veintiuno. Veintiuno. Veintidós. Number twenty-two. Veintidós. Then we have Veintitrés, which is twenty-three. Veintitrés. And finally we have veinticuatro. Veinticuatro. So when we begin the line of twenties, we add veinte to uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Veintiuno, veintidós, veintitrés, veinticuatro. What about twenty-five? The same pattern. Veinticinco. Veintiséis, veintisiete, and veintiocho. So the veinte is added to cinco, seis, siete, and ocho, and it becomes veinticinco, seis, veintisiete, veintiocho. Then we have number twenty-nine. Number twenty-nine is called veintinueve. Nine is nueve, so twenty-nine is veintinueve. And then we have number thirty. Number thirty is called treinta. Treinta. That's thirty. So the thirties line will begin with treinta. So treinta y uno. That's number thirty-one. Treinta y dos. That's number thirty-two. Treinta y dos. The important thing to note here is that when we are starting the numbers from thirties till hundred. 
we always have an e in the middle so that 30 and 1 30 and 2 30 and 3 so 30 e 1 30 e 2 moving on 30 e 3 that's number 33 for you 30 e 3 30 e 4 30 e 5 30 e 6 that's 35 and 36 respectively then how do we say 37 30 e 7 30 e 8 30 e 9 and finally number 40 which is 40 40 that's number 40 for you all right 41 40 e 1 so you will see the pattern is the same as 30 the numbers will have 40 then e which means an and then 40 e 1 42 43 and 44 all right continuing that's 45 45 46 47 and finally 48 number 48 how do we say 49 then in the same way that's 49 49 49 49 and then we have number 50 which is 50 50 that's 50 51 same pattern again we have a 50 then we have an and and then we have uno so 50 e uno 50 e dos don't forget the e which means and 53 50 e tres 50 e cuatro 50 e cinco 50 e seis i hope it's clear to everybody 57 57 is 50 e Siete, because siete is number seven. We have cincuenta y ocho, which is number eight. So fifty-eight becomes cincuenta y ocho. Number fifty-nine, cincuenta y nueve. And finally, we have number sixty. And number sixty is called sesenta. That's called sesenta in Spanish. So now the line of Sesentas is going to start. Sesenta y uno, sixty-one. Sesenta y dos, sixty-two. Sesenta y tres, sixty-three. And then we have sixty-four, which is sesenta y cuatro. Let's continue. Sesenta y cinco, which is sixty-five. 66, number 66, 67, which is number 67, and then we have 68, which is number 68. How do we say 69? No points for guessing, that is 69, 69. Then what do we have? We have here 70. Number 70 is called 70. Caution. 60 is called 60. And 70 is called 70. It takes a while to remember, but please don't replace 60 and 70. Okay? 60, 60 is called 60. 70 is called 70. Number 71. 70 in uno. 70 in uno. Number 72. 70 in dos. 
the same pattern but now with setanta we have setanta e3 73 setanta e4 74 setanta e5 number 75 and then setanta e6 Says is six, seventy is seventy, e is an. So seventy and six makes it a seventy-six. Okay. Now what is this? Setenta y siete. Setenta y siete is seventy and a seven. Seventy and a seven makes a seventy-seven. Setenta y ocho. Seventy-eight. Setenta y nueve is a seventy-nine, and then we have number eighty. Eighty is called ochenta. Ochenta. That's number eighty. Okay, so the line of eighties is from ochenta. So we have ochenta y uno, ochenta y dos, ochenta y tres, ochenta y cuatro, ochenta y Quattro number eighty four. Ochenta e cinco eighty five. Ochenta e cinco. Ochenta e seis eighty six. Ochenta e siete eighty seven. Six is seis siete is seven. So it is an ochenta e seis and ochenta e siete. Then we have ochenta e ocho. And finally, ochenta y nueve, eighty-nine. Okay, now we start the next decade, which is the nineties. Nineties called noventa. Nine is nueve, and ninety is noventa. So noventa becomes noventa y uno, noventa y dos, noventa y tres, noventa y cuatro. Noventa y cinco, noventa y seis, number ninety six, noventa y seis, and finally we have a ninety seven, which is noventa y siete, ninety and seven makes it a ninety seven, noventa y siete, then noventa y ocho. Ninety-eight, noventa y ocho, ninety-nine, noventa y nueve, noventa y nueve, and finally, number hundred, which is called cien, cien. That's number hundred for you. I hope you're clear with the counting from one to hundred in Spanish. It's a, it follows a specific pattern like we have in other languages. You have to understand the ten, which is the s, veinte, twenty, treinta, thirty, cuarenta, forty, cincuenta, fifty, sesenta, sixty, setenta, seventy, ochenta, eighty, noventa, ninety, and a cien, which is a Hundred. A tip for you all: Please rewatch the video again and go with the pronunciations while I'm speaking, so you can speak alongside and repeat the pronunciations with me to memorize it better. All right. Thank you, everybody. Bye bye.